Well, hello. So, do you know what day it is today? Do you? It is pumpkin carving day, isn't it? It is, but I'm not excited for it. Why are you not excited for pumpkin? Because Josh won't let me have as many pumpkins as I want to have. Well, it's not that I won't, <coughs> I won't let her. It's just that no one's going to be trick or treating because that apparently does not matter. Halloween's cancelled this year. Also, we live like right in the corner house, down a drive, well out of the way, lovely and quiet, but no one sees our pumpkins except us. Do so, you think I'm carving my pumpkins for anyone else? What do you think of the children? No, I'm not going to be any anywhere. That's true. <laughs> but anyway, we got two big old pumpkins from um, Aldi. My, my idea was I wanted to do um, a puking pumpkin because we do a puking pumpkin every year now so like it's a tradition plus it looks really really good um, so I wanted a, pu a puking pumpkin um, I thought you said a puking pumpkin at the, top, at the top of the steps and then I wanted like a nest of three big pumpkins someone said no let's get the pumpkins out that we've got so we've got two so basically it's going to be a puking pumpkin and one one other pumpkin and it's gonna look poo poo lauren's enthusiasm everyone let's get the pumpkins so look here are the pumpkins we've got one two pumpkins and a overexcited black cat but here's the thing he's not overexcited by the pumpkins no he's overexcited by the bin bag that i've opened up that we're going to carve the pumpkins on He's a bit confused. A bit confused, aren't you? Yes. Lauren's also trying to get her, like a, a fancy Instagram photo. I've got loads of fancy Instagram photos. I literally just want a quick one of him from my stories, but he's not playing. He's not cooperative. What's this? Nice pumpkin. Yeah, no. Nice carrier bag. No nice carrier bags. No. Okay, let's let's get to a cutting. Look, nice pumpkins. No. Okay, so first things first, this is the puking pumpkin, this one. I'm going to draw a face on it with a biro pen, like so. we got one eye, there's an eye, two eyes, and then a big old puking mouth. Look at Buddy. Buddy. Buddy! Nah, it's not bothered. So now it's time to hollow him out, like take all the bits inside out. So we're gonna have to stick this in his head. Lauren, do you wanna do the uh, the initial stab into his brain? Watch my hands. I thought you'd do it much more violently than that. Like this. That was no different. So I've took the lid off the first one. I made the hole kind of small. It's not like a human hand size. It's more of like a Jeremy Beadle hand size. And I've not got a Jeremy Beadle hand. Or you know, like him off of... Um, what's that film? Is it Scary Movie? Where he's got a little hand. Like him. But it's all right. We can make it work. Ooh, I didn't think there were a lot of seeds in here to start with, but there are. So it's kind of hard to see in there, but there's a lot of... A lot of seedage going on. But I saw a thing. I saw a thing that I want to try. Uh, I don't know if it's going to work. I've got high hopes though. <laughs> this could go terribly. Let me, let me show you what I'm going to do. So I've got a drill. And I've got a whisk. Right, I feel like... You know... <laughs> You know when you watch like murder programs and someone proper plans like a murder out and they hang like plastic sheets on the walls and stuff so there's no blood splatters? Kind of like that. I feel like I need to hang plastic sheets because there's going to be pumpkin splatters all over the wall. I don't. I've, I've got confidence in myself. <laughs> that I just feel like this is going to go everywhere. <laughs> this is a good way to make mashed potato if nothing else. Okay. Let's do it. Are we ready? No. <laughs> Three, two, one. Ah! <laughs> that went exactly as I expected. Yeah! Have it! Way! Is it actually. 
Is it actually doing anything? <laughs> <laughs> don't do that, I'll go on the rug. Oh yeah. <gasps> Josh! <laughs> So I've realised that I can't exactly get the mushed up pumpkin out of this tiny little orifice. So I'm going to cut the mouth out and take all the crap out from the mouth hole. And then put it in a bowl. Oh yeah, then put it in a bowl <laughs> so Lauren can use it as like the... It's puke. It's the vomit. It's the vomit. This is much easier to cut than it should be. I don't know why. Yeah. It's just taking a lot of concentration. A lot of effort is going into correctly doing this. Let's, let's give him a bigger mouth. He's got a pretty mouth. Let's give it an extra blast with the old uh, uh, No! Invention. It's going to come out of its mouth! Oh my god! Oh, it's literally puking! Man, don't mush it up too much! Oh my god! I feel like a neurosurgeon. Go on, guy. Puke. This works much better you need than to get that. I thought it would. Get his. Uh, come on, he's blowing chunks. We don't want chunks, though. We want string. Help, help him. Ah, that's the good stuff. Knife to the eye. Ugh. That was the centre of the eye. That wasn't a good part of the eye. Ugh. Yeah, Dobby can't resist. He really wants to get involved. Here we go. Hey Dobby. Although I actually think he's more interested in the kitchen rather than the pumpkin. He's been a little bit camera shy at the minute, but that's okay. No one needs to see that. That, ladies and gentlemen, is pumpkin number one. The puking pumpkin as it will be, eventually. Pumpkin one. Now on to pumpkin number... They do look really good though, don't they? Oh yeah, they do. Here. <laughs> the puking ones do look really good. Like I said, this is the third puking one we've done now isn't it yeah and once they've got the candle in them and all the blech coming out of its mouth it looks really good true that this one though this one we're doing something with this one that we've never done before <laughs> which is why we've got the drill so we're going to try drilling pretty patterns on this one which is why we've got the drill it wasn't for whipping out the insides however it's a very uneven pumpkin and the better side to use is this one that's all warty it's yeah. just gonna be, so, it's gonna look like a pin cushion. It's not gonna look like a pin cushion. It's gonna look like they do on Pinterest, okay? <laughs> <laughs> okay. So we've got the lid removed from pumpkin number two. I've sort of mashed up the innards <laughs> with a knife. <laughs> yeah, wow, that's blurry. But anyway, next, it's whisk time. Are you excited? Because I'm certainly excited. This works much better than I thought it would. In, <laughs> on. Woo! Yeah! Look at that! It's fucking! <laughs> Up next, we have selected drill bit number <laughs> six. You just wanted to use number ten. Well, yeah. I feel like we should have gone eight. And we've lost seven. Yeah, I don't know, don't where, know seven where seven is, is. But we've gone for six, and then if we need to go bigger, at least we've got that option. Yeah. Yeah. So it might not look like much, but we're going for a spiral design. And then I'm going to drill holes every so often. Which, now I'm looking at it, I feel like the holes do need to be smaller. Because, yeah. Because, like... Because... I that's... didn't actually... That might be an What do you think? Let me look. Ugh. I still think number seven would have been best, but we don't have a number seven. We're going to go with number six. <laughs> so I did some drilling, but what I did was I alternated between the size six and a size four, four I think. Yeah, four's missing. Because I feel like just six on its own would have looked a bit ridiculous. But put put your, put your phone light in, Lauren, let's... Look at that, that works out. I think that was really good. Quite well, right, that. Keep drilling now. That's what she said. <laughs> Yeah. So 
Slurren got a bit jealous. She wanted to have a go at the old uh, drilling the pumpkin I game. I didn't realise how heavy the drill was, though. It's a drill. Okay, do it. This is Lauren's <laughs> one and only. Ooh. <laughs> and then back out. And then the next one. Right there. Yeah. Oh, this is... If I could be bothered to scoop out a pumpkin, I'd do another one of these drilled ones myself tomorrow. Oh, this is quite good. I like this. Yeah. <laughs> this is kind of fun. Can you tell we've had nothing else to do in 2020? I'm finding drilling a pumpkin really fun. <laughs> Oh, that is actually really fun. I want, I really want to <laughs> drill one tomorrow. If you know what she means. Sha -ta -ta! There you go, look, there's a, uh, like a spirally, a spirally pumpkin. Guess which one Lauren did? <laughs> this one here, this is this mass, this cluster of <laughs> bullet marks there. <laughs> but other than that, I think if you're not very good at carving pumpkins, because they can be quite tough, can't they? Yeah. That is definitely the way to go for design, like doing a design, because I think that looks really good. It does, actually. So, yeah. I think next year, next year we will have my little cluster of drilled pumpkins, because <laughs> I think that looks really effective and it's really easy. True that. And now... We're going to tidy up. Well, we're going to go and put them outside first. So I want some pictures, then we'll tidy up. Yeah. So now comes the positioning of the pumpkins. Well, he needs to go a little bit further back, doesn't he? Because he's got stuff coming out of his mouth. Yeah. Why don't you put them both next to each other like best friends? Next to each other? Yeah. We're just thinking about people getting to the door. Well, it's going to be harder for them to squeeze between two than just past two that are next to each other. So like that, you mean? No. What? <laughs> So like, one there, one there, next to each other. No, but they need, that needs to be moved back to get the sick to come out. Don't worry. No. Lauren's just on the sick duty. <laughs> Trying oh. to get all the stringy bits. <laughs> oh, I'm making it gross. There's no like really stringy ones to... The lighting is not good out here. Does that look okay? <laughs> I mean, it's definitely thrown up. Does that look all right? Yeah, let's get a candle in it. Oh, I'm gonna have to wipe my hands first. That's one candle dropped in there. Candle two is gonna have to go through his mouth. <laughs> Don't knock his sick. I'm not going to knock his sick. <laughs> oh, I think I'm going to knock his sick. Ooh, yeah. Nailed it. There they are, lit up. In their pumpkin -y form. That drill one looks really good, actually. It does, doesn't it? I mean, they both look good, but I will say the drill one looks better. Yeah. I think, like, next year, hopefully we can have trick-or-treaters again. So I'm thinking there, like here, we'd have a patch. Drilled ones. A patch of drilled pumpkins. Drilled pumpkins. Okay, Dobby's in the window, he agrees. If you enjoyed this vlog, please give it a thumbs up and a subscribe if you're not already. And with that being said, we're going to get gone, so we'll see you guys next time. She said that so quietly because we're outside. <laughs> next time. Calm down. <laughs>